The health department is speaking out tonight after it poured bleach on food at a local group's event meant to feed the homeless. Officials shut down that event yesterday because the group didn't have a permit. 41 Action News reporter Jordan Betts live at the park where it happened near 12th and Prospect. Now, Jordan, what exactly happened yesterday? Yeah, so this group actually comes to this park. This is Prospect Plaza Park, as well as other parks around the city to feed the homeless. Well, when they arrived yesterday, they were met by the health department and police. Um, so you guys are conducting illegal food service. We're having a picnic with friends. We invited illegal. the public. It is well, these are my friends. Nellie McCool has been helping the homeless in Kansas City for years until Sunday. Officers and the health inspectors demanded that we destroy our food and they were saying that we were violating health code violations by sharing meals with our friends. The health department said the group wasn't following the law about serving the homeless. They were notified back in September at a meeting that they needed to get a permit and they just outright said they would refuse to do that. But McCool said she never heard from the department. That's incorrect. We've never had any kind of government official ever come and speak with anybody at any of the public parks. According to the department, the permit is free and all organizations that want to serve the homeless or anyone food need this permit. Archer said the food was also not being handled correctly and could put others at risk. Preparing food in all these individual homes when people haven't been trained to prepare food safely and then they're taking it and transporting it in trunks of cars mm -hmm. when it's cool. It's supposed to be warm food, but they've got no insulation or way to keep the food warm. Archer says when the department tried to take the food away, volunteers got angry. At one of the sites when they were informed that they were not going to be able to serve because they didn't have a permit and weren't doing it safely, mm -hmm. they actually threw some of the food at our inspector. <laughs> McCool disputes that, claiming one of her volunteers got upset and threw the food on the ground. Inspectors then poured bleach on the food to make sure nobody ate it. A standard procedure in public health is to go ahead and pour bleach on the food mm -hmm. so that people won't consume something that's dangerous. Despite being shut down, organizers say they will continue to serve. So from now on, you guys will continue no matter what? No matter what. <laughs> Now, the department says they will actually be contacting the group to decide how they will go forward. Mayor Sly James actually just tweeted about an hour ago about the situation saying, quote, rules are there to protect the public's health and all groups must follow them. No exceptions in Kansas City. Jordan Betts, 41 Action News.